actually okay. The <laughs> Such a weird price. <laughs> was it was um it was the paneling wasn't quite wide enough. I felt like so I thought this one was a really good deal. This one has also got those tie in the middle, but this front part um with G. I really like the fit. The bottom half was quite. Revealing. Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a trying on cheap eBay swimsuits video. So let's get straight into the video and I'll show you guys which ones I picked up. So the first one I have is this tropical print triangle bikini. Um, so this is what the top half looks like and then bottom half looks like this. These ones are actually okay, these were one of the more expensive pairs I bought. This one was such a weird price. <laughs> but I bought this in a size medium. Often um, they can be quite mean with their sizes like the prom dresses so um, make sure to size up if you're thinking about buying this. This one comes with little pads in it which on some of these was awful but this one actually the padding fits quite well into the cup. So yeah overall quite happy with this one. The only thing that I didn't like was the fastening at the back was quite cheap feeling. Like it doesn't lock into place, it could just come open at any point which is quite scary <laughs> for a bikini. But overall I like this one, the pattern is really cute, it's quite blue toned, not very um, greeny which you'd expect it to be. Um, but yeah, overall I would probably keep this one. Next up I got this little crochet one. Um, which the top half looks like this and then the bottoms just look like this. I thought I'd bought this in a size medium but they actually say large on them which is interesting. When I tried this on the fit was actually quite nice. Um, the bottoms fit perfectly and then the top was, it was um, it was okay but the, I feel like the straps were way too long so it didn't really have much support. Um, which was a shame. I bought a similar style to this before from a different eBay shop and the fit of that one was much better but I can never find it now and I think I got that one in a medium so probably get a medium in this one instead of a large which I think is okay for this one it's pretty good quality for that much so yeah I would give this one a thumbs up. Next up is this white all-in-one and it's got the sort of crisscross over the back and then just a lower part. I'll show you guys when I try it on. But I bought this in a medium and it was just a very strange fit. The front panelling wasn't quite wide enough, I felt like I could pop out. Um, and it also came with like weird circular pads in which I took out straight away because they looked so strange. If this swimsuit fitted properly it would have looked so nice so I'm really annoyed that it's not lived up to its expectations down the drain to be honest. Um, so I wouldn't recommend this one. This next one is kind of looking as though it should be crochet, but it's actually just printed on, um, which is okay, I guess. It doesn't look too bad. To be fair, this is one of the ones that fitted the best. And this was, so I thought this one was a really good deal. This one has also got those weird circle pad things in, which are literally just a circle. <laughs> um, and the, you can't take them out of this one, which is, oh no you can, you can you can take them out of it. So overall I'm really pleased with this one and I would definitely recommend it, if you're... although this one did take the longest to get here so you won't be getting it very quickly. <laughs> Next up we've got another all-in-one swimsuit and like the white one I really hoped that this would have worked but it didn't really. It's this stripy cut out all in one and it's got a little tie in the middle but this front part was just way too big and it just gaped out in front of my tummy so maybe as a maternity item it would be great <laughs> and yeah just the overall feel of this fabric is it's horrible if so again don't bother with this one next up is this black lace-up swimsuit and I feel like there was no pattern whatsoever for this and they just cut a rectangle out and sewed it together because it was so gapy around the back and it just didn't fit the body at all. The lace up detailing was really pretty so maybe I'd wear this as like a bodysuit um, with jeans or something but I mean the straps, I don't know if I'd trust the straps either because they were quite flimsy feeling. So yeah, disappointed in this one again. So for 6 99 it's not too bad but then again I feel like 
you'd find a swimsuit in Primark for that price or cheaper and it would be much better. But oh well, it was worth a try and I might wear it as a top. <laughs> then we have this really cute little pink bikini. This is what the top half looks like and then the bottom half just looks like this. Um, I'm a bit worried about the colour of this because I mean it's quite like nude um, compared to my pale skin. <laughs> I feel like if you have a darker tan it would work a bit better with you. Um, but overall I really like the fit. The bottom half is quite revealing so I wouldn't wear this in England I don't think. I'd only wear it on holiday. But yeah, happy with this one, would we'll give this one a thumbs up. Then this is the final one and I was probably the most excited about this one coming. But it is awful. <laughs> it's like the black one, I feel like they've just cut out two massive rectangles and just sewn it together. Um, this is in a size medium. Um, it's got this horrible netting ruffling down the side which just doesn't look anything like the one in the picture. The fabric is completely see-through. The bottom part has a um, seam down the back which is just not where you want a seam. Completely not recommend this at all. Don't even go near this. <laughs> so that is the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it as always. And yeah, I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye!